Hi, this is Josh with Resort TV One, and today I'm taking you on a relaxing stroll around Africa at Disney's Animal Kingdom in 4K. We hope you enjoy the video. Love these gates here as you come into the land and start to get ready to cross the bridge over here. And before you cross the bridge, make sure you take a look at the beautiful views here out to the waterway. By the way, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell. Buy the subscribe button to enable notifications every time we go live or have a new video. Also, check us out on all the social media. Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. We're Resort TV One on all of those platforms, so check us out. Let's go look at Everest here. Though it's a cloudy day, that's still a really good view of Everest right across the water there. And on the other side of the bridge, we have this equally beautiful view of the Lion King Theater and some scenery just to the side of that. Boats and all kinds of really cool stuff. Love the reflection in the water as well. This is such a detailed area here in Africa. Make sure you take time to look around and just enjoy the beautiful views here. I love this sign as you come in here. It's got a lot of the uh, things you can do here, the restaurants and all kinds of things listed. Almost like miniature advertisements. <laughs> We're gonna go by Festival of the Lion King a little bit later, but I wanna take you into the main area of Harambe here, and it's very busy right now. They've got some live music going on right there uh, in front of the Tusker house here. There's Tamu Tamu refreshments and I've been told that you can get Dole Whip there and it looks like I am right. We have Dole Whip. That is big news. On the right, you have a restroom area. These buildings are all so detailed. All right, now obviously Harambe is always crowded here, but there are places to get out of the way and out of the hustle and bustle a little bit, at least relatively so. And one of these places is this, uh, what says Harambe Fort. Kind of an eating area back here, and especially at night, this place is almost deserted. It's a great place to get out of the way and just to enjoy a little bit of peace and quiet back here. Sorry about the wind from the fan as we go by here. The detail in this area is just so amazing, all over Africa. All right, so we'll head back out towards the main area. And you can see they're setting up for a musical performance here. They do have musical performances here on the square quite often in Harambe. And it was raining earlier, so I'm sure that's why they didn't do them earlier today. Let's head up towards the safari and then we'll uh, explore a few other areas.
And the Mombasa Marketplace is the main uh, gift shop area here in Harambe, Africa. Take a detour here and just look at some of the detail. Just amazing. I love all the faded signs and posters and slogans on the sides of all these buildings. Just amazing. And you should take the time to stop and enjoy those things because uh, a lot of people just rush to the ride and don't have time and so that's why I make these videos but when you are here maybe you can uh, find some of these things for yourself and say oh yeah I saw that on the video. This tree here by the way is called a baobab tree. Also nicknamed the upside down tree. It's leafless for the majority of the year. And they tell you all about that on the safari. So here's the entrance to Kilimanjaro safaris. And we head over to Rafiki's Planet Watch. There's also a really nice little eating area. So instead of going towards Rafiki's Planet Watch, we'll head towards uh, the Zawani Traders and the Zuri Sweet Shop. So here's Zawani Traders. This is another uh, gift shop. And you can get to the Mombasa Marketplace through this area, but a lot of really cool uh, gifts and drums and all kinds of things that you can buy. So. Maybe we'll do a video just of the shop here. I'll let Jenna do that though. There's Zuri Sweet Shop, home of the gummy spiders, even though they haven't had any for a while. Now here's a tip for everybody. Just to the left of Zuri Sweet Shop is this really cool area that is usually much less crowded than the main pathway in the main square in Harambe so something definitely that I would recommend checking out this is so cool this little bicycle land area it looks like something that would be like a route 66 attraction or something except for it's in Africa So we'll take a look at the food market over here. And again, just a lot of great detail. Even Mickey Mouse on the side of the uh, building there. So cool. By the way, this gentleman is the one creating all the beautiful music. Relaxing. I don't know what is. That's amazing. I honestly thought it was a CD. It's that good. This little marketplace is really cool. This is just so well themed here. tell you to have a fine day. All right, so 
cool. That pathway takes you back to Rafiki's Planet Watch. How they got the music amplified so that it follows you all throughout this area. And from here, we will head across the pathway over towards the Festival of the Lion King building. Very crowded in this area. It looks like maybe the show just got out. We may wait just a second, let it clear out. All right, so now we're heading back towards Festival of the Lion King. I let the crowd clear as much as I could. Here's the side of the Tusker house. Again, just so much detail here. Before we go down there too far, let's take a look over here at this waterway area. This is what we were looking at from the bridge earlier, but it's a little bit closer view. main entrance to the festival festival of the Lion King show and this used to be back in uh, Camp Mini Mickey which is now Pandora so they moved this over here so they could still continue to offer this amazing show but again it used to be in Pandora or where Pandora is now in an area that was called Camp Mini Mickey a lot of really cool theming over here. There you can see that bridge we were on earlier that, as we started the video actually. And by the way if you keep walking past the festival of the Lion King you will end up in Pandora. So the show actually didn't move too far. Okay. 
And right before you get to the main path to Pandora, they've got this really well-themed uh, rest restroom building. Disney does the best themed restrooms, that's for sure. I don't know if that's a, a distinction that they want or not. Alright, we're going to head back out of this area and we're going to head back towards the main entrance to Africa where we started the video. And really, there's just a lot of detail here in Africa, like I said, so we've barely scratched the surface of everything you can go look at. So, you know, when it's super crowded, and even though it's a little crowded here today, I encourage you to take the time to just explore this amazing area. So that's all for our relaxing stroll around Africa in Disney's Animal Kingdom in 4K. We hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure that you leave us a like and a comment. That really helps the video and helps us if you do that. Also, make sure that you check out our sponsor, MickeyBlog.com and MickeyTravels.com for the best in free Disney vacation planning advice, as well as WindowRepairParts.us and use the coupon code RESORTTV1 for 20% off of your purchase on WindowRepairParts.us. So as we come back out into the main square here in Harambe, we will say goodbye. So for now, have a great big beautiful tomorrow. Bye bye. Now that you've finished watching this video, be sure that you're subscribed so that you can get all of the latest updates. Also, check out some other great videos on our channel. Have a great big beautiful tomorrow. Bye bye.